The best news for dealers is that with an aging fleet of trucks, sooner or later, operators will have to replace them. And that, in my opinion, is the biggest driver to have a pretty optimistic outlook into the years to come. Dom cited major challenges like production supply shortages and enhanced customer demands for first-class products and service. I would say OAM and truck dealers have to work hand in hand to match and the brand who can figure out the best package for the customer, that brand ultimately will win in the market. But winning at the dealer level will require well-trained employees. A very difficult thing to sell trucks because you have to know so much, but it will be more difficult in the future. That means education uh, is key for you, for your personnel, for your sales guys, for your service guys. You have to invest into human capital, send your, send your guys to all the academies, send them to the, to, to the training courses which is out, and invest in, in the young kids coming out of high school, get them a good vocational training to be good mechanics in your service shops, because you will need them in the future and you will rather need them more than less. Dom closed his presentation with an emphatic call to dealers to constantly upgrade technician training and to invest in the future now by drawing attention in their community schools to the value of a career in the trucking industry. Lisa Kreitz, NADA-TV.